because you don't have the focus to be mastering yourself. That's why you keep on choking and damaging yourself, pulling out your fucking notepad, embarrassing yourself. <laughs> All them years smoking weed made you cannabis yourself. <laughs> Management for having us through. We're in here for the third battle of the three party. It's night number one of APW. Let's get straight into it. This is a grudge match for the ages. Let's settle this right now. The testosterone is gonna go through the fucking roof. It's gonna get too hype. Let's get it popping right about now. MC on my right hand side, training days, event coordinator, my G Daddy Jack. Make some noise. Let's go. <laughs> On the left hand side, I genuinely just heard somebody say, Are oh, you shotty horror? It's Raw, it's Mexico! Highest Raptor! Shout out shotty horror! Shout out Manchester! Shout out Daddy Jack! Shout out Young Raw! Raptor! Right, he flipped off cam! It's gonna be three rounds, don't flop, eighth birthday weekend, my man Danny Jack, round number one, whenever you wanna go, bruv, let's go. Yo! Yo! See, when I got this battle, I ran Frankie. So they got raw, so I gotta to get to snapping. He said, fuck that battle. It should never happen. He's dead at rapping. The only reason he's got respect is because he got gem to back him now. See that conversation there? It never happened. <laughs> 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 I did ring Frank. So I got raws. So it's time to step it up and up my penmanship. He said, oh yeah, swear down. That's sick, bro. <laughs> and that was the end. <laughs> You're wet, bro. You're wet beyond belief. You're wet like telling women to cover up on the beach. You're wet like claiming you're just a nice guy from the streets on a meme. You're wet like posting nice guys finish last when she's not on the D, but newsflash, bro. Freestyling for four hours is not what she wants to see. <laughs> Whenever I see him try it with chicks, I don't back you. <laughs> At seventh birthday, you refer to a girl as your beef. True. I'm surprised she didn't slap you. <laughs> I did do that, but I was joking. Not really. <laughs> I never got why you were like this, but now I think I understand you refer to women as your beef because they're just there for you to rap to. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna tell you a story. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you a story that's 100 percent true. Let me expand on the image. Let me expand on the imagery. We're in the pub mixing potions like we're practicing wizardry. We're going back and forth with each other, and the banner is killing me until he goes, You're not like me, bruv. <laughs> you don't get girls with your rapping ability. 100 percent facts. He doesn't. I don't. I don't get girls. With my rapping a bit, I, you know, right, you're right, I don't. <laughs> I don't get girls with my rapping ability. I mean, all this time I thought it was good looks and financial stability. <laughs> A girl could be laying there naked saying you can have a virginity, you'd misunderstand the word beat and start rapping politically. <laughs> Imagine Rose meets a chick. She's a huge sex freak. She wants to go back to his and his smooth bed sheets. She says she wants to go down. She's got a new technique. He says a new technique. You beg, please. I bet you've only heard Dance with the Devil. <laughs> <laughs> went deep. She says he's misunderstood and starts faking a laugh. She's, he starts spraying his bars about fucking snakes in the grass. All yeah. fucking free star, by the way. He has about 86 bars, pulls a YouTube slider back and sprays a game from the start. <laughs> <laughs> now I know this story might be fabricated in parts, but everybody in this fucking room knows the way that you are. Yeah. Yeah. So my last few 
bells haven't been on my best form because I weren't having the best time so I couldn't give you the best roars but now it's weapons drawn and you'll take the penalties so I can settle scores my tryout was a body I'm not stopping till I get some more because in my first battle I was hungry thought I had something to prove in my last was battling life Thought I had nothing to lose, wasn't the finished article Was dumbstruck by the news, cause can't pretend I see red when I suffer the blues And bro, <laughs> and bro, you don't have the heart to dwell where I'm at so hard a well When I rap the darkness fell because I camouflage myself till everything is black Vince McMahon, you don't have a chance in hell, should have warned you you can't prevail, you've got no bars Best get one or go round in circles no matter how far you sell With one punch you're stuck against the wall mm. My hand as hard as nails, I don't shot but if I did a man was off the cells, I'll make dough from everyone I telegram like Alexander Bell because I've gathered vast in Bruv, I've gathered vast in tell. So what I sport inside this battle might be foul. Like Michael Jordan tried to travel. This is like when mm. dinosaurs were alive with mammals or Christ was born inside a chapel. I'll mow them down. My fire will get inside your cyber channel, Vency RKO. Like I was Orton trying to grapple the deaths I record like mm. Ryan Morgan aligned with Bagnall cause between night and dawn the light has travelled now mm. I've matured like wine is stored inside a barrel cause I am Roars mm. <laughs> And you couldn't fight my force inside I'm agile but my inner kid is 66 Now I bring yours to show this child is fragile cause 8th birthday For bringing water here get a few bumps like a camel now I've lost the plot <laughs> <laughs> Now I've lost the plot this might unravel cause they made you starve you. <laughs> <laughs> Bruv. Whoever was on that signing panel's decline was gradual. They just had a long shot like Ryan Babble and made problems worse, which they tried to tackle because putting you in charge of anything. Oh, I'm madness. Uh. But I don't give a fuck if you're a star. <laughs> so tell you to suck a fat dick. Because <laughs> if you think that'll give Dan the upper hand shit, you need another tactic because you tried to branch out as a battle rapper. But still can't budget and that sticks, plus money don't go on trees. So you don't get no fee for what they lumberjack with and yeah, and yeah. Next in line, and next in line was sick. You come a long way from being a nervous wreck. And I ain't gonna lie. It might be something that her regrets. You even had a DF Snapchat filter. On your first event. <laughs> Looks like you earn respect. But it's just like that Snapchat filter. Because it has the reverse effect soon as you turn your head. Time. Now, yo, now in this battle, you thought you were gonna par me. Hardly. You were popping the first time round, but dead the second time you were out like a Rachis. You jar me, because you got the talent. But monkeying around left you dead like a Rambi. Now you stop reliving them old days, and you still playing the Atari, so now it's time to kill. I'm Silent Hill, or Resident Evil, what? You can't see. No matter what it is you produce, there's no way you can arm me. Now, Resident Evil, Silent Hill, can arm me. I got it. Resident Evil, Silent Hill, Konami, see that bar there? Nasty, Wallahi, what I'm speaking to you. See that bar there? Nasty, Wallahi, what I'm speaking to you is Indian food, because that right there was a bar, G. <laughs> Head wrapped if I let it sink now I'm playing. Yo, <laughs> you fell all the way off. But my progression has been hurting you gradually, which is why I'm not surprised you put the word into battle me. The post, the trolls. Bro, you don't think I've been observing your strategy. I see the game that they don't. That's virtual reality, fam. Imagine if Imagine if you put some, took some time off the internet and held help fixing your mind state. But instead I see roars all over my screen like emo bitches on MySpace. Mm. <laughs> Responding to YouTube comments, he sees one and he gets rattled, starts raging, going more red than the dislikes in this battle. <laughs> That's all for you, bro. Then he said, then he says he's gonna ghost from the battling scene and he's back in a week. Do us a favor, actually leave. <laughs> but the internet is just one thing. Being your friend is something else. Fucking hell, if someone wants to end my pain, I'd love that help. Because you love the coke fam. I don't know how he handles it. White girl in the bag, that's a brownies camping trip. <laughs> We tell you to allow the drugs, but you keep refusing the message, we just choose to accept it. After a few drinks, he's on the coat getting rude and aggressive, so it's like he's a white beater. Bang on the white girl after too many Stellas. Oh. Time, man, time. Yeah. You got ready to hear some bars, yeah? Alright, yo, listen. Yo. 
Um, Royal Rumble 2015! <laughs> Back when this trolling began. <laughs> exactly. I'm gonna say that again. Yo! <laughs> Royal Rumble 2015! Uh. Back when this trolling began. Now, we're on 8th birthday. And I know that it's mad, but let me show you some facts. I knew you was whack before the moment you rapped. Then you opened your mouth. Then you choked and collapsed. But you'll know that you're whack. We just humour you, prick. You're right. I never stopped rapping. But I reckon if you did, you could be sick. I mean, bro. I mean, I mean, come on now. Come on now, wait a minute, wait a minute. Think all the stuff you could do with your chick. I don't know. Go to the movies and shit. Maybe even see Drake. You get on the train, the door closes as she waits, and you're like, and it's Danny Jack! And I get off next stop way, but I don't want to be late, because let's be grown ups. Imagine him, imagine this girl introducing him to her parents. <laughs> like, this is Dean. He works at Heathrow Parts. He's a pilot. He flies overseas no fast. The pressure gets to him, they ask more questions, and he owns up like, well, no, nah, well, I'm not a pilot. <laughs> but if you had a certain battle up, it was deep oak fog. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> they angrily say no. <laughs> they angrily say no. He looks at Bianca because he's so fucked and he's like, do something. And she's like, well, that's not all, Dad, because uh, Sharon also stole Dean's coat once. Because we cracked bear jokes, bro. <laughs> Listen, we cracked bear jokes, bro. But now, this friendship is over. Because since this battle got confirmed, we've drifted. But your death has got closer. We have a pint and mad last can accept you're a joker. Then I wake up and realise how much I hate being your friend when I'm sober. Because you... Because <laughs> you... Got a naturally beggy persona. <laughs> School careers day enthusiastic. Oh. Like I want to be wet when I'm older. You probably... <laughs> you probably fucked your girl, but then argue whenever you bone her because she didn't want to lay near the wet spot. So you just slept on the sofa. <laughs> Calm down, wait, wait, wait. Who told Tidal Richie? <laughs> yo, listen. Yo, who told Tidal Richie? You can try and diss me. Eh. Who told Luther Van Washed? <laughs> <laughs> who, told, who told Luther Van Washed that you would get mad pots? Because, yo, I promise not to write no personals. But I couldn't do that well. <laughs> so stop telling people your name's Dean. When you, Danielle, you're the bitch in your relationship. Look close and you can tell you have romantic weekends, lip syncing, breathe. But she's Sean Paul and you're blue, can't tell. Cause bruv, cause bruv, you're so under the thumb. Bruv, you're so under the thumb. Your girl went for a routine checkup. Doctors discovered a lump. It was you. Like I just. <laughs> But she's Sean Paul and your blue can't tell because bro, you're so under the thumb. You went for a routine checkup. Your girl went for a routine checkup. The doctors discovered a lump. It was you! Like I just came in case something was up and you know. Ha, she might get stressed. I need to cut and stuff. Cause yo, you couldn't be more wet if you were found washed up on a seashore, dead. I'd be a limit. <laughs> yo! Listen! Yo, you you literally couldn't be more wet if you were found washed up on a seashore, dead. I be in limousines, telling girls I need more head. What's your crying to Drizzy G? Begging Bianca all week for sex, cause she ain't giving you none. Slow it down, I said she ain't giving you none. Cause when another writes it, oh yo, listen, we need to talk. I've got some issues with you. Yo, listen, Danny Jack, we need to talk. Because I've got some issues with you. And I don't want you to take this the wrong way. And think I don't like your chick. Because I do. I just don't like the music she's restricting you to. Because I mean, if she was Australian, you wouldn't pick up the digital day. <laughs> Bro, we used to be in these streets. And now you're more Indian flutes. Because want to know what rhymes with Danny Jack? Bro, you want to know what rhymes with Danny Jack, huh? Bianca forces him to make banger tracks. And if you don't buy a lamb madras, then no sex, he best have a wank. <laughs> I'm joking, I'm joking. That was Bant for Battle Rap. 
I've got one though. You wanna know who Danny Jack loves Bianca? Ooh, your girlfriend Avi Dean, you fucking wanker, because who wants a girlfriend anyway? <laughs> <laughs> me? I'd rather be single and lonely. I've got some bad bitch on me now. That chick doesn't know me five minutes <laughs> later. <laughs> Who wants a girlfriend anyway? <laughs> me? I'd rather be single and lonely. I've got some bad bitch on me now. <laughs> that chick doesn't know me. Five minutes into the date, I make a miserable homie. Some people end their dates with a kiss. Mine end with please do not phone me. And listen. <laughs> and listen. And listen. Don't be predictable. Because I already know what you're going to say. Something about me talking shit, then losing to what's his face. And it may have been in another league. But I know a battle that never gone your way, so yeah, I lost in Reading. But pussy, yo, you lost in Shut up, Jay! Shut up, Jay! See what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? Land, I planned that. Time. Time, let's time. This round, yo, this round is where I start bringing it home. This kid is a joke. Mm. If it wasn't for Gemini, locksmithing and in tow, nobody in this fucking room would hear you spitting a flow. So do us all a favour, quit it and go. Because you're against Danny Jack in battle rap. And I am shit at it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I still look down on you with fire like a military drone. I hear the whispers. I've been listening low like a chip, like a chip in your phone. You push for this, and now you're fucked like dick in a hole with chlamydia. So I think you should know that this back and forth we've had. I mean, yeah, it's been dope, but are you winning this? No, because the finish is close like vinegar strokes. You silly little <laughs> pause. You silly little twat. I didn't come here to compete with your ability to rap. That's Good. all you have. Yo, man. Sorry. You silly little twat. I didn't come here to compete with your ability to rap. That's all you have, and that's the biggest difference with this fam. They only see you as a rapper. They don't see you as a man, they only see you as inadequate. You stay living in your dreams like you've been in the animus, there's something blocking you. Because inside, I can see there's a beast that's an animal that can rise and move that block like Jesus and Nazareth. Mm. Now, I'm, mm. now imagine, I was out one time in the town with my mates. I looked up, I see one guy shout out on the stage, it was roars. He was going in. It was the first time I see him shut it down in the race. So upon leaving, I made sure I looked out for his name. But the maddest thing is, that was 2008. <laughs> Whatever it was you had planned out in your brain has massively failed to go down in that way. Because all now, you're out here losing to 1-4-2. I did. <laughs> this balance shit is long for you. Yeah. <laughs> you, you went on stage through a tangent and stomped your boots like, oh, he's just rhyming words, bro. Oh, yeah, shit, mate. One thing you're not to do. <laughs> <laughs> I don't understand how you can get so Larry when you lost to 1-4-2. He rapped like he went through puberty there and then. <laughs> you lost to one for two. So the hype, I am not having it, mate. I told you no person. <laughs> Sorry. You lost the one fucking prick. You lost the what's called. You lost the one for two. Yo, yo, please, yo. Well, you lost the one for so the hype I'm not having it mate. Yeah, I know I lost in my battle with Jace, but that has the same amount of views Alex has in his name. <laughs> I'm sorry, but if you thought this was friendly time, then you fought wrong. Hey yo, Gemini, this is your Don. Talk to him. You're his last hope of getting better. You should catch a cheap shot in his mouth like Penn and Teller. You have the mm. self-awareness of Helen Keller. You just, you just don't mm. want to be lonely like Fred McGregor. Ah, fuck up. You just don't want to be lonely like Fred McGregor. You, you sex means to build a love story like Ed and Bella. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, Fucking down. sex memes, bro. And the whole, oh, I'm single story as well. Fucking Stevie Wonder could look at your timeline and already tell. <laughs> <laughs> and you want to call me wet, bro? Me? Okay. If I really am this wet guy, then compared to you, I'm about as dry as your sex life. <laughs> Carry on, carry on. You 
fucking desperate, offensive, stressed to be friends with. Everyone says this, you just don't get the message. You're just extra, pathetic, so you reflection and check it and you will see why you have never had any sexual endeavors. Oh, oh, now, 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 Roz, now, Roz, now, Roz, now, Roz, I've dealt with your shit for over a year, so I can finally say it's done. I didn't come here to outbar you or even win. I just came to say you're a cunt. <laughs> but we're friends. And this battle. We're what? friends. But we're friends. And this battle, at least it was fun. I still have to fucking miss Tony D versus Pat Stay. So uh, fuck this battle. We need to get drunk. <laughs> Sorry, bro. That's your chick's fault, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, bro. No, no, no. Yo! Alright, listen. Alright. Wanna hear some bars, yeah? Alright, cool. <laughs> Yo! Let's go, let's go. <coughs> you argue with strangers and Drake haters in his Instagram comments. <laughs> and I'd usually say that you were mad. If you're thinking Dan's got this, but you know, Trump won the election. So that's shit I can't promise, but what I can is you being a bitch. And I get tired of feminism. But you can hear two guys in a pub discussing lunch. And say stop sexualizing women and you're not sexist. <laughs> so if you tell your goal to get inside the kitchen is to protect more rising victims because everyone has died that has ever tried these dishes, bruv. If I cooked like you. <laughs> if I cooked like you. <laughs> I'd ask Gordon Ramsay to bore and shank me, tweet Jamie. <laughs> Yo! Let's go, Ross. Listen. If I cook like you, I told Gordon Ramsay to bore and shank me, tweet Jamie Oliver, like, could you slaughter man, please? Or go on MasterChef just for the free food. Then call the taxi. Because, yo, you're an embarrassment. Literally one of the wettest of guys. You aggressively cried to Beverly Knight. This isn't what you're called. Yo! You're literally one of the wettest of guys. You aggressively cried to Beverly Knight, this isn't what your girl wanted when she said get in touch with your feminine side. <laughs> Yo, listen, there's being in touch with your feminine side. You was getting a hug. And I ain't gonna talk shit about the dress that's been done. And you probably accept it was done. But I will say, I can imagine it now. Your girl sends you a pic of a maid outfit. You're like, sexy! When she's home, she gets fucked. But you forgot. <laughs> it's actually for the tea parties where she dresses you up Cause bro, where is your girl now? I was hoping you'd have that skeptic side Just so I could tell that bitch to suck it I'm Triple H in a cage dressed in DX attire Lay her on the mat just to give her my hard D I'm a death defier But then, she's more of a man than you You're basically having sex with China You couldn't go bar <laughs> With me. You know why? I'm a heavy writer. Your jokes in gasoline the crowd. But I expect the bars they get a lighter. We came in the Undertaker. If I have to kill my bro to get me higher, then all you will see from Raw is war. I don't condone in friendly fire, so I treated this like just another battle. Hoping we could have a banging match. You're gonna lose. <laughs> but being a team player will make up for what your talent lacks, so play your position. Cause if you start moving like the Captain Jack, then think Johnny Depp when he lost his ex. Cause once I batter this bitch, they'll know I weren't just acting mad. Yeah, mm. yeah, they wanted that voice for my tryout. But after the year I've had was always gonna be harder, cause I won that battle convincingly. Then literally lost my dad two weeks after. So when it finally got uploaded, and people were viewing my talent, it was hard to take in what had happened, cause I was funeral planning. I never took a break, but I should've. But then I guess it's ironic, cause them shit battles were something to focus on to take my mind off it. That's why I manic. My life's been tragic. If you woke up to my world, this guy would panic. You'd get lost inside the planet like Atlantis or the Bermuda Triangle when then pilot crashes. Bro. bro, you couldn't go bar for bar with me. You'd get left. Cause what I write all damage like Tyson swag it impact, then watch Jack collide with traffic, then <laughs> this guy will vanish just like it's magic Cause yo Cause yo Yo, they wanted me to clown you But I can't, I can't mask I wanted to make a madness happen Cause bar for bar If we met in the middle You couldn't exist You'd get lit because Jack a lantern But now this is over You're still wet wow. <laughs> Just had to get rid of Jack like the iPhone 7 times. <laughs>